Hello, people. I shouldn't have to tell you, but I will remind you that if you don't stand up for your own rights, nobody's going to stand up for your own rights. And uh, we need to stand up together against this machine, the government. By right, I'm talking about William Blackstone's thoughts on right. Let me just read these two, these words from William Blackstone. He's one of the old law men, back when rights were rights. By the absolute right of individuals, we mean those which are so in their primary and strictest sense, such as would belong to their persons merely in a state of nature, and which every man is entitled to enjoy whether out of society or in it. But with regard to the absolute duties which man is bound to perform, considered as a mere individual, it is not to be expected that any human municipal law should at all explain or enforce them, for the end and intent of such laws being only to regulate the behavior of mankind as they are members of society and stand in various relations to each other. They have consequently no concern with any other but social or relative duties. Let a man therefore be so ever abandoned in his principles or vicious in his practice, provided he keeps his wickedness to himself and does not offend against the rules of public decency, he is out of the reach of human laws. Ha ha ha, their own law man. Sir William Blackstone wrote that, and I'd live by that, and I'd, we can take this country back, watch the peaceful revolution, I have a solution, and it's through the jury, and it's a little bit better explained in there, just please watch that video too, thanks.